Switching gears now, tiny houses solving a big problem. The Driftwood Housing Project's Tiny Home Village aims at helping people experiencing homelessness off the streets. WKRG News 5's Tiffany Gray spoke with organizers about what they're doing in Mobile. Tiffany? Yes, Dana, this organization is making major efforts here in Mobile to help our homeless community. Every third Sunday of the month, Central Presbyterian Church serves as the location where members from the Driftwood Housing Project host an outreach helping people experiencing homelessness. And, uh, we have about 100 homeless people that live within this block, this area. Um, and so what we do is once a month, we... Um, we, we gather socks and coats. Not only do they provide clothing, but they also provide toiletries, a meal, and blessing bags with items to get them through the week. This was the last winter outreach at the church as the group looks for a more successful location. We're quickly kind of finding out that, you know, these people kind of have rituals and whatever, you know, for surviving, for surviving. And so uh, this will probably be the, the last outreach that we do here and but we'll probably just start taking things to them in their encampment. These efforts are in addition to the overall project the Driftwood Housing Project is working on. In the next five years they plan to create a community aimed to help the homeless get back on their feet. We have a, a AutoCAD operator. I drew up some plans of what I thought the village should look like and he's audit, putting it on AutoCAD and sent me some drafts of it. We have two draft writers that are researching how we can fund this project. This couple says everything they do is in efforts to make a change in their local community. These people, a lot of people are just one paycheck away from being homeless or living in their car. Before, you know, we close our eyes for the last time, we'd like to leave some sort of legacy. And I think this would be a really good one. The Driftwood Housing Project meets at 2 o'clock every fourth Sunday of the month at Central Presbyterian Church. They're welcoming new people to join the movement in creating this village. In the studio, Tiffany Gray, WKRG News 5.